Right, we have made it. We're here all the way to the Premier Inn at Heathrow Airport. We're not quite at Orlando just yet. So it's the Premier Inn on Bath Road for Terminal 2 and 3. Okay, we're in. We're in the room. Uh, oh, this is a bit of a mishmash. Um, on the other videos I've seen of this place, it's um, a bit old styley. So I've got a nice view of Bath Road. There we go. I did want an airport view, but no. Um, anyway, <laughs> so this is. Uh, like an old style room. They've got newer refurbished rooms at different hotels, but they're sort of sh showing signs of age. Um, so these are older still. So anyway, I'll give you a quick room tour. Um, it's a pretty much a bog standard premier in room. If you're from the UK, you've seen these before, I'm sure. But if you're not, I'll give you a quick a room tour. So we've got some sort of bed, single bed there, sofa, big king size bed, queen size bed, not sure. Desk, TV, mirror, there, hello. You've got hair dryer, you've got all your coffee making stuff, tea making stuff, uh, somewhere to hang your Hang some clothes, not that I'm gonna do much unpacking. There is a safe down there, probably won't use that. And of course there is a bathroom. There we go. Again, hello, mirror and a bathtub. So pretty, like I say, pretty standard affair really. For, but it's clean, it's close to the airport, so yeah, what else do you need? Okay, so no sound for this bit. I mean, what's the point of having a fancy mic if I don't actually turn it on? But anyway, we're on our way to Terminal 3 to get our COVID test, and we're gonna catch a bus from right outside the hotel. Right, so we walked down to the next bus stop because I realized the next bus stop is in the free Heathrow Airport Zone, free bus ride airport zone. Got to save those pennies, haven't we, Lou? Got to save those pennies. 105 or the 111, I'm thinking. What? 105 in two minutes. Maybe I'm weird, but I do love that sound. You love the sound? Yeah. Maybe I'm weird, but I love the smell of petrol. I do like the smell of petrol. I love the smell of aviation fuel in the morning. <laughs> yeah, the McDonald's is all the way down there. So where's the KFC? KFC was back up there, I'm sure. There's another little walk in the other direction. See, we're already planning our American food tasting mission. What are we going to call it? We just want to try lots of different American burgers, basically. We've had five guys recently. That was yeah. the best, I think. We had five guys. It was okay. It was taste. It tasted great, actually. It was a lot. It was a nice but burger. But it was Chips expensive. Were a bit, um, yeah. It was expensive, so we'll have to try five guys at Disney Springs. So five guys at Disney yeah. Springs. Yeah, I saw it on Tim Tracker's oh. video the other day. Hey mate, we're going to Terminal 3. Are we inside the airport zone? Are we inside the free airport, free airport travel zone? 
No, it doesn't exist anymore, no? No, <laughs> okay. We're, we're a bit out of date. Right, they scrapped it. Fair enough. Cheers, mate, thank you. Thank you. Well, there you go, the free airport zone, the free travel zone that we walked an extra 10 minutes for now no longer exists. Oh well, we're on the bus though. Terminal 3. Well, this is a bit confusing, but we're trying to figure it out. I thought you get off the bus, walk across the road, and run into Terminal 3, but apparently we got this travel later to contend with okay so we've got to get our covid tests from the uh from the express check express test express express test place behind us but we're a bit early in fact we're about three hours early so uh, i wasn't sure they'd be able to do it for us but um they said come back in 10 15 minutes if you don't mind and we said that's brilliant thank you very much we'll have that so we just gotta wait 15 minutes and we can go and get a test we'll go and have some dinner chill out hopefully get a Negatory. negative negative result hopefully okay so we got our tests done we got in early we had an 20 past eight we had an eight, eight appointment. o'clock appointment for the oh, I thought it was uh, eight twenty two but i think it was eight o'clock for anyway, the test we got there before just before five yep and they said yeah, come back 10, 10, 15 minutes later um, and we'll get you in. And we did that and we went straight in. Mm -hmm. There was a little bit of a queue inside. It took us about 20 minutes, didn't it, once yeah. we were in the queue? Yeah. Um, one poor chap who's been mm. kicked off a flight and had to rebook another flight because he, because he didn't get his test done. So it cost him thousands of pounds, thousand pounds or whatever, mm. flying to Guam. So like those flights don't come around very often. So he was not very happy. He was a bit disgruntled. There was other people behind us trying to jump the queue because they were in a rush. Um, just a couple of things, but most of it was pretty calm and pretty easy um, in the end. Yeah. Um, so we had our um, antigen test uh, swabs done, whatever they're called. And what, half an hour, 40 minutes later, it we've got long, our results. It was actually it took a bit longer than they said. They said it would be half an hour, 40 minutes, but I think it was a little bit longer than that. I think it took me right. about an hour, but it was an hour before I saw the email. Yeah, so, maybe we weren't checking. Yeah, maybe it was that I didn't have a signal or something, but yeah. it did seem like a longer time than they said. Yeah. So, um, yeah, do you want to tell them the news or shall I? You better. Well, it turns out that we're both negative. Yay. Yes. So tomorrow we're going to Orlando. Yay. Whoop, whoop. Yay. <laughs> Fantastic. Really happy. Yeah. Um, Phew. We wanted to film, I wanted to film a, like a reaction video when we first opened our emails. Louise was a bit too nervous for that, so we was like, okay, let's not, oh yeah. God. Okay, let's not do that, let's do it, let's do it now. Yeah. So, yeah, that's it. We're going to Orlando yes. tomorrow. So this, 
holiday for us has been a, um, a year in the planning. Um, I decided sort of May last year, um, I had this money saved from not having to commute into London every day. And I really wanted to go, I've been a huge Harry Potter fan for a, um, a long time. And um, I just, I think I just happened to see somebody's video on YouTube. You know, it was, it was locked down. There wasn't, you know, a lot, lot to do. I was watching lots of YouTube and um, somebody went to the Harry Potter studio um, and then I started watching more of their videos and they were in the Wizarding World in Florida and I thought, I have to go. I absolutely have to go. And, um, and then we, I you know, roped Trevor into coming with me because none of my friends went to come with me. Well, they couldn't come with me. Um, I knew nothing about Wizarding World. I didn't know, I didn't know there was anything at, at Universal. Um, so yeah, I said, right, fair enough, I'll go with you, let's do it. Um, and then we started looking into it. We started looking into like watching videos on YouTube. And then I saw a video and realized that there was actually Star Wars yeah. at Disney. It was the Millennium Falcon at, at Disney. So I was like, oh, well, we have to go there one day. And the more we looked into yeah. it, the more, the more Disney stuff we had to do. Yeah. Um, we even extended our stay another two nights to get another two nights staying at Disney. So, so we're going to be staying at um, Universal End of Summer Resort for the first um, seven nights. Yep. And then we've got two nights at Disney's uh, Pop Century Resort. So that's our plan. Is the, the first first half of our stay, the first sort of four or well, three and a half um, days is Universal. Um, the weekend in between is a bit free. We might be going to Universal. We might go back to, I would go to Epcot maybe on the Sunday. Yeah, uh, I want to do some trading. pin trading, yeah. Um, you know, and there's a few other things. We want to go to Sonic, don't we? There's yeah, Sonic uh, drive-in, uh, you know, classic old school mm -hmm. burgers and um, yeah, uh, burger restaurant. Uh, like I say, shopping. Disney Springs, things like that, yeah. and then the second half of our tra uh, the second half of our holiday is more Disney. So it's um, yeah. So we'll be staying at Universal end of summer, traveling to Disney for a couple of days, yeah. and then we're actually down at Disney, staying at um, like say Pop Century, mm -hmm. um, getting a Skyliner yes. to Disney. Yes, really so, looking forward to that. Yes, so that's a rough plan of what's coming up next. So, um, yeah, from next week, uh, it's uh, Universal. Yeah, so, so we, our flight is, did we say what, what our flight was? Half one tomorrow? So half one tomorrow, uh, eight hours, nine hours, something like that. I think they said the outward flight was about nine hours. Yep. To um, uh, MCO. MCO, yeah. MCO, we mm -hmm. haven't got a... We haven't got transport booked no. from the airport to endless summer. So we'll have to figure out a yeah. Uber or Uber. a Lyft. First time any of us have done, I, first time either of us have done Uber. So that's a whole new thing. Yeah. Um, and we'll go into America's the first for me and the first for Louisa. Mm -hmm. So the whole thing, everything is a brand new experience for us. Not yeah. just Disney, not just Universal, but all everything. Firsts. It's all firsts. Yeah. So, hopefully you enjoy the videos that have come. And if you want to get in touch with us, then we'll be, I'll be put, putting some photos out daily. So we're on Instagram if you want to follow us, um, at Wizard and Mouse. We'll put the link on the screen. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll be sharing posts daily. So if you want to drop us a comment and any suggestions of where you think we should go, anything we need to check out, mm. um, yeah, that'd be great. So, okay, we'll leave it there for tonight. So if you can subscribe, please, that'd be uh, much appreciated. Obviously, uh, tap that like button as well, please. And ring that notification bell so you're um, notified of any new videos we put out. Okay, well, bye for now. Bye.